So it's time for the much awaited sequel of my Pokemon pack openings. I got myself eight packs from like a thing, as you can see from the coins. Got like a few cool coins. Got this cool Ginset coin. And this rare quartz coin. Probably should just say it louder because you know that I say it wrong anyway. Anyway. These were these were the four cards on the co on just the front nut. We got a Mora pack. This Fanfi. A single strike Snorlax. And an Eevee. Okay. So, we'll start with this pack. As we know, these are impossible to open, though. But I learned from the first video that I have to just try really hard to open them. Well, that was not the correct way. It was supposed to start with an energy, but it didn't. Got a Rapid Strike Britzel. Got Cast Form. This is probably the rare. Got a Sour's Book. Water Energy. Fire Resistant Mitts. Opian. I've heard this card. I'm pretty sure this card's overpowered. Celio. But as we know, I don't actually play the game. I just collect the cards. A Clobopus. A Single Strike Weedle. A Galarian Slowpoke. And a Quillfish. Single Strike. Okay, move on to the next pack. I should actually order through the card. Should really put the cards in not just a pile. I'll just make an after video of like what all the rare cards were. Whoops, forgot to open this one on screen. We'll try shuffle in Three to the back instead. And see whether that works. Still didn't work. We'll just open them normally. Like, I don't know what the shuffling order is. You told me what it was, but it didn't work. So we've got Marip. Another Clobopus. God. Karen's Conventions. Gonna see the Marin manager. Got a Weezin. Got a Steel Energy. A Stir Sweetie. A weird looking tree. A Rapid Strike Scroll. Is this from Legend Arceus? Wait, the scroll can attack? A Snova and a cast form. Rainy form. And then a Routes. Okay, next pack. Last one was a Molt Trace one. The first one was Articuno, so we got another Articuno one. Yeah, these packs actually aren't opening too bad. So, another brittle super strike. No rapid strike. 
got to move the cards because they're actually in the. I moved them in the way of myself. Another Snova single strike. A Sensel. Not a Sneasel, but a Sensel. A Swirlix. Whoops, skipped a card. The ba a band card known as Polygrin. I mean Polygon. Cub Fu. A Viper single strike. <laughs> An electric energy. Another Stir Sweetie. A Larion. And a Hatrim. Alright. Time to do the other Moltres pack. So we got a hat, Hatterina, Hatran, a cast form, snowy form, a clobberpus, a golet, a ladybra, and a sunarine, a walrine. Need the seal now. It's a feel. Otherwise, not as her. You know, the round one. Steel energy. Polygon two. And an impact energy. Single strike. And old cemetery. Okay. Now we'll do. The one with this black horse on it. Shame I get whip. Seems like my only good pack. Got a single strike Wemple. No Weedle. Got a snow rent. The crab baller. Slow proke. Snowver. You know what? <sighs> Got a really good Heracross. Single strike. Damn, this is so difficult. Oh, I did get a good card after all. We got ourselves Blaziken. V form. So I didn't give away all my good packs, at least. Even if I only give away one pack. At least I still got a V form myself. Lucky energy. Well, this seemed to be a lucky pack. Not as lucky as the first time, time through, though. That gold thing was amazing. And some character that nobody knows. Known as Catelyn. Okay, we'll do the white horse pack this time. I don't know the names of these legendaries. I never actually got uh, Crown Tundra. Or Isle of Armour. So we got the Snova, your mask, Galarian form, Coffin, which for some reason is a dark type. Why is Coffin dark type? We got Galarian Slowpoke, got Dearlin, a really bad card. Oh, we got another gold card. But it's not completely gold this time. 
This is why I do this, because it always ends up pulling something like this. Oh wait, also this is like really overpowered in metal decks. Because that metal transfer is broken as well. I know a little bit about the Pokemon trading card game now. Oh nice, an unnamed person, they're just called Doctor. A Haunter. And Kalara, the one who photoshops her trainer card. I may not play the game, but I know that she photoshopped her trainer card to get bigger boobs in the game. Because you can clearly see because the slow bro in the background is all blurred from it. Then we got another black horse pack. Got a cub foo as the first, but I'm gonna put it on screen. We have already had it, but this one doesn't have the fighting energies on it. Or as it said, ground energies. A single straight shup it. Got a score bunny with a snowball, single strike. Diggler rapid strike. In K with a bunch of food. Ampharos. Tornadoes! V form! These these things are kind of these legendaries are weird though. Tornadoes and Thunderous. And then Landorus. Lady N. The alternate version of the Photoshop person. And Honey. I wonder if there's someone actually called Honey. Why is it... Like, it's just weird. Alright, last pack. And the last pack is another Articuno pack. At least these packs aren't like, as difficult to open as the previous time. Looks like we got... Oh, we got that rodent that nobody remembers because... These Gen 1 rodents, they're just unrememberable. Like the completely forgettable rodent from Sword and Shield. Another Inkay. Sobble. Rapid Strike. Another Heracross, but without the Reverse Hollow. Polygon, so Band. Spiritomb, reverse hollow, but very difficult to see because dark is very difficult to see for this. Another Tornadus, shiny form, but it's not, oh wait, no, this one isn't just a V form, this is V, V masks form. A steel energy. Hat trim. And a fog crystal. And then we got Thwacky. Wow, these stars had middle gen ones had terrible names. Okay, I'll make another video after I sort through the good cards.